Hi friends, today we're going to be looking at the Sewell Echo HDMI to 4K upscaler and downscaler. So this device allows you to take an HDMI signal and convert it up or down. Um, so we're going to be taking a closer look at that, doing some unboxing and just take a first look at this device. First thing I want to show you, this is the Amazon ad. Here uh, at the time of purchase, it was about $65. So not super cheap, not super expensive, kind of in between. Uh, but for that upscaling capabilities, I'm excited to see how this functions and to see how this does. So let's go ahead and uh, take a closer look at the unboxing. All right, so here is the box that it comes in. It is actually pretty fancy. Connects anything it says here on the side and then has the website, sewelldirect.com with their logo, a barcode, and then there is a quote here that says, if you have anything less than a five-star experience, please let us know and we'll make it right. So it sounds like they are on top of that. I will point out on the Amazon page, it is a four-star product. Let's see, currently it is a four out of five. Okay, with uh, just 12 reviews, so hopefully it'll go up with my review. Maybe, I think it would. So here's the device itself. Um, once we pull the top off, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the device out. It's actually got a little bit of a heft to it, a little bit of weight to it. I'm gonna take off this plastic, shed its skin, and that is metal right there, folks. Yeah, that's solid. Um, it's Now that I have this in my hands, it, um, for the size of the device, it's actually not super heavy, so that's good. Yeah, Echo HDMI to 4, 4K upscaler. So you have the HDMI out, you have a USB for looks like updating. I don't know if it can power over, over USB and that's a, a mini cable. And you have your resolution, your zoom, and your HDMI versus Stevia. I don't know why you would have that button if you only have one HDMI in, but it is what it is. So we also have HDMI in and then audio out. So if you need audio separate in your output, then it splits it off. Um, I wonder if this HDMI out also combines that audio send. We'll find out um, during my tests in a little bit. So uh, I want to set this aside here because below this box, I'm hoping, yes, there is a power here. So I'm going to pull that out. We're also going to pull the manual out. Let's go ahead and get rid of the box at this point. So here is a quick start guide for this product. Basically plug it in. <laughs> Um, yeah, email support, that kind of stuff is all listed there. We have a shorter power cable with a rubber band, so I'll knock that off. It looks to be about four feet in this cable length. Pretty standard plug here. Looks like it's a five volt DC in. That slides right in, then you would plug this in. So basically, yeah, you could take a 1080p signal from an output of something and then upscale it to 4K to work with 4K devices. In my particular case, I am a video producer. I have a multicam setup, and so I'm gonna use this particular device to upscale a computer's output that's 1080p up to 4K, so it'll work with my ATEM2ME production switcher. That does sound a little bit cumbersome and uh, there's a lot of gear that's involved but hopefully this will keep up so i can help make that transition make that scale uh, easy so that's pretty much it um, i'm not going to show this thing in action today but look for it on my youtube channel or in future videos